Hello everyone! Today I will introduce you to these beautiful items that I received from Moonrise Creek, which are all vegan and cruelty free by the way. This brand doesn't work with toxins or chemicals, instead they only offer handcrafted botanical goods, which I absolutely love. They are a very earth conscious company and since they are still an exception out there, I think it's very important to promote these businesses who actually care about our planet. Oh, and by the way, I'm not getting paid for this video. I only received their products and since I'm still super happy with their quality after using them for a few months now, I wanted to film this video. So as always, I'm starting off by wearing my foundation and a chapstick. Both of these products are in the description box. The first product that I'll be using for my Moonrise Creek collection is the Aromatherapy Oil Moon Dance. I've also listed some of its ingredients here. So to use it, just roll the vial on your wrist and rub it in wherever you want to apply it. I like to rub it on my wrist and my neck and it smells so good by the way. I think I could best describe it as walking through a forest after it has been raining. Next I will be using the under eye elixir to hydrate and tighten my sleepy eyes. Because my day to day life due to running my own business, going to university plus blogging is always quite stressful. And even though I'm trying to get my 6 hours of sleep at night, I often look quite tired. So you gently roll the product onto the skin under your eyes and massage it in afterwards. Of course I need some powder to set my foundation and this is probably my favorite item of my Moonrise Creek collection. At first I had the fear that it could be a bit too dark for my skin tone because I always used white powder before. This is definitely not the case. It's a mineral foundation powder with a matte light coverage and you can really feel that it's without chemicals or synthetics. My skin got so much better since I'm using this product and I even got the feeling that my pores are much smaller now. And since I'm trying to create a makeup look here, I also will be using some of my own products um, as the products that I'm using here to contour my cheeks and my nose, but they are also all listed in the video description. After contouring, I will highlight my nose tip with just a little bit of highlighter. For my eyes, I will be using a dark plum cream eyeshadow. And of course, I will blend it. After that, I will be using a lip product, but I only use it for my eyes because I don't really like this coral color on my lips. But it's a lipstick and I will also just put it over the dark plum eyeshadow. And of course I will blend these two together. Next I will be using the mineral eyeshadow in the color charcoal. Because of course when I can pick a color I always pick black. And this eyeshadow can be intensified with layering. Meaning if you want a light grey color you can just layer once and if you want to have it very very black you can just use a little bit more layers. I will also highlight my eyelids a little bit and the part on my eyes. For my lips, I will be using the Brick Red Lip Balm, which is a tint and shine for the lips. You can also layer it over a lipstick for a beautiful red shine, as I layered it here over my chapstick and over my lip liner. 
but it's not for a lipstick boldness. I usually wear it when I just want a very subtle color on my lips and when my lips feel a bit dry. For this look I will also be using some blush because I want to look very healthy and I will also use a little bit of blush under my nose because I always think that it makes you look very cute. And of course I will also do my eyebrows and I use a black eyebrow pencil and I will blend the sides, the back of my brows and the front part to make it look a little bit more natural. Well, the camera decided to focus on my hand, but I'm just doing my regular cat eye. And I also draw a tiny line under my eyes. And I will also use a little bit of highlighter in my inner eye corner. And next I will be using this moon pendant that I got from eBay, I think, and it only costed around one euro. And I just used a little bit of eyelash glue and glue it on my forehead. Sadly, my camera decided to don't focus on my face anymore, but I'm just using my eyeliner here to create some dots on my face. And this is the whole look with the Moonrise Creek product. They got a huge variety of different products and they are really worth checking out. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.